Welcome to Draw Tip Tuesday! Here's the background wash that I made last week. Remember the one with the cling foil? For a funky background effect, I placed cling foil on a wet watercolor. Of course, I can't leave it like this, so I decide to draw something on it. I am drawing the outline and I am focusing on the negative spaces. The negative space is the space around the subject. This means you need to look at everything but the subject. I'm looking at the shapes around my subject. Like here, I see a triangle-like space. So I draw it. When I draw the rest of the negative shapes I see around the subject, they will form the final shape, in which I can add details later. If you train yourself in looking at the negative spaces of a subject, it will get easier to switch off your part of the brain that names things. So instead of thinking, I am drawing cherry tomatoes, they are round and they should be shiny and they have complicated green crowns and stems, you will be thinking, I see a triangle and there is a squarish bit and uh, maybe you can see proportions between them so you draw them in without focusing on or even thinking about the final result. It will take a bit of practice, but once you know how to just look at the negative spaces, it will really get easier. If you draw your hand, for instance, you don't draw your fingers, but you draw the space that you see around it. So you see shapes between your fingers and those shapes you will be drawing. That's the negative space. In the meantime, as you can see, I started drawing in shadows using the hatching technique. Next week, I will also color the cherry tomatoes in and give them a bit of shine. So, well, I hope to see you next week in the next episode of Draw Tip Tuesday. Thank you for watching this video. If you want to learn more, check out my website on koshukuna.nl.